virus is helping shine light on another major health problem impacting people in one part of Birmingham. WVTM 13's Chip Scarborough says residents there believe they've been forgotten. Dozens of cars formed a caravan in North Birmingham Saturday morning to protest something organizers say is a matter of life and death. It's very ironic about this that we got to wear these masks. We should have been wearing these masks in these neighborhoods years ago. Charlie Powell with People Against Neighborhood Industrial Contamination is talking about environmental pollution in and around the 35th Avenue North Superfund site. Many cars had signs taped to them with messages such as we can't breathe and care for air. Pollution is not fair. We're getting murdered every day by chemicals. Then we got the COVID-19 monster and we got the pollution monster. We need somebody to do something about it. This is an injustice to us and our families for generations to come. Those who organized Saturday's caravan say the environmental pollution has not only been harmful to people's health, it's also hindered the growth of their community. We never asked the plant to shut down, close, or leave. We want to leave. We want fair market value of our homes, which don't value nothing now. Everything now is overgrown with grass and houses are falling in. This is a shame and a disgrace. It's like living in a prison. And protesters are really hoping to get the Superfund site on the national protection list so they can really get to cleaning up the pollution in the area. It's also an action required by the Environmental Protection Agency. Chip Scarborough, WVTM 13.